Hello. <clears throat> hey there, hi there, ho there, everyone. Welcome to uh, Dave and Shecky Mac Podcast Unboxing. We bought this a year ago. This is from MyPatriotSupply.com. No, they're not sponsoring us, but we never really looked into it. So we figured, let's look into it. And we, they had a special on RSBN for one week supply. And it was really cheap. I think it was like $40 or something. And honestly, this container, I think it's pretty dope. You could probably use it. It's an ammo box. Is it an ammo box? Well, that's what it's supposed to look like. Oh, okay. I didn't know. Maybe it is. Oh, let me check it out. But it's like a pelican case, right? It gets it closes pretty. It's an ammo box. It's an ammo box, okay? So <clears throat> it's got these nice flip up things, and does it does it come off completely, or does it just open like this? I think maybe it just opens. Ammo boxes just open like this. Is that true? What do you? How do you? How are you an uh, ammo box king? I don't. Yeah, uh, I, I price ammo boxes. Do go you? To, go to stores and I, I browse ammo boxes. I didn't realize. Oh okay. yeah. Oh yeah. What do you can do with an ammo box? Right here, you got your little compartments. Uh huh. Yeah, you keep keep it open. Put your screws there. Oh, that no, because then when you close it, it becomes a problem. Well, I don't use my ammo box for ammo. Oh, I was gonna say because I don't know that there's screws in ammo boxes. Well, anyway, uh, I put my figurines in there. What? Oh, okay. My Hulk, my Hulk cat, my what? <laughs> my Hulk figurine and my David Banner figurine. Oh, oh. Then I have my little reenactments that I play out uh, when well, you're sleeping. Uh, why aren't you wearing your Hulk shirt then? Uh, I'm just going Hulk green. Hulk green for Patty's Day, Saint. Oh, okay. It is no longer Saint Patty's Day, but that's fine. All right. So at the very top. Oh, I must have been listening to a rerun. <laughs> what? A rerun of what? I don't know. Whatever I was listening to, they said it was St. Patty's Day. I thought today was the day, but I guess it was an old show. It was yesterday. Ah, yesterday's show. Yesterday's news. All right. So, I guess the name of this this package is Ready Hour, but it definitely was from... Ready Hour? I think it's from My Patriot Supply. I think Man, so. That's a subsidiary of My Patriot. <clears throat> Ready Hour. So... Made in the USA, creamy chicken flavored rice. This is a lot. Wait a minute. You have to cook this? Yeah. It says open pouch and remove oxygen absorber. Bring five cups of water to boil. Whisk in entire contents of pouch. Reduce heat to medium and continue cooking for 20 minutes. Now, what sounds better? Oxygen absorber or a silicate package? Package. Uh, silicate. Silicate packet. Silicate sounds a little weird to me. It sounds like, like oxygen, some... oxygen absorber sounds like some sort of aliens taking over. Oh well, I, well, Remove honestly though, absorber. these last for twenty five years, so maybe it's not the same thing. All right, well, okay, you got me there. <clears throat> I certainly do. So anyway, this is a lot. This is uh, four servings. Four servings and. 490 calories a serving. I think we're going to start making this stuff and just doing taste tests. Mm -hmm. Maybe even right after this unboxing video. So, creamy chicken flavored rice. That sounds good to me, honestly. Yeah, Black bean soup. I guess all of these are going to be four servings. Uh, open pouch, rem remove absorber. Water, 15 minutes. Why don't you put it in your figurines department? There you go. What do you got? I just... Next. Black bean soup. Yeah, I heard that one. What's next? Oh, okay. I thought you wanted to touch everything. No. I, I can pass on that one. Okay. This one is I think you'll like. Ah. <clears throat> Maple Grove Oatmeal. Now that sounds good. <coughs> that does not sound good. <coughs> well, you know. Made with old-fashioned oats, maple flavoring, and a pinch of brown sugar. That's racist. 
I don't know why you say that. I don't know. Ask the Rolling Stones. <clears throat> Again, this is... Oh, this is eight servings. Uh, that's a lot of oatmeal. Let's see. How does this stack up to just a regular oatmeal? It's probably quite similar, I would say. Hmm. This one's bad for you. Shush! Oh. Well. Why would you say that? The second ingredient is sugar. Yeah, but maybe that has something to do with keeping it around for 25 years. Also, honestly, if you're in into the point where you need to use these, I don't think you're going to care if there's too much sugar in it. Mm. I think you're like, it's the apocalypse. Shit is going crazy around you. In the apocalypse, it's I want time. my oatmeal sugar free. Okay, well, you, you know what? Then you're it's gonna called porridge. To... All right. I'm. You know what? Instead of that, give me some of that dehydrated ice cream shit they used to have in the eighties. Okay, we are we are going through this right now. Until they endorse me, I am not going to do them any favors. All right. Well, then why did you agree to do this? Well, I like doing it. I'm oh, just I being honest. I don't think that sugar should be the second ingredient, but prove <laughs> me wrong. Look, if you have little kids and I do not the the, the neighborhood is being bombed, or you have all right, you got a the point zombie there. apocalypse. Better than better oatmeal than no oatmeal. Exactly. Now you're thinking. Okay. Ooh, traveler's stew, which you will not be having because you're staying in one place. You'll be hunkered now, <clears throat> but you can dream of travel. This is a, we're back to the four servings. Made with pasta, lentils, onions, and celery in a rich chicken-flavored broth. All right. That sounds good. I think this sounds wonderful. It all sounds good so far. I'm you just, know what? It seems like... I'm just jesting. Huh? Huh? It seems like we're not getting any repeats, maybe. I don't know. Oh. Well, that's good. we got a small pack here. Uh, well, this is just the week. That's true. Long grain white rice. So this is, oh, this one is 30 years. Yeah, regular rice is 20. Is that true? I don't know, is I it? I don't know. Uh, just white rice. Good. No sugar, Dave. See? Hold on, Grabby. Grabby wants to look. This is 10 servings. Nice. At 170 calories per serving. Let me just flip that around before Grabby takes it. Go ahead, grab it. Grab it. Ooh, now here's one I can get behind. I would buy a whole week's worth of this particular item. Breakfast, lunch, and dinner. It's macaroni and cheese. This is obviously just one serving, but it's claiming to be four servings. 320 calories a piece. I, I think that's... I think that's low. Let me see. You know, if you're like doing the Velveeta or something, Let me have that grab it. Grab this after the macaroni and cheese. Ooh. Well, I feel substantial. I feel like I've won the lottery because there's two of them. <laughs> uh -oh. Thank you, mac and cheese gods. What's wrong? Something's causing this. It's releasing a toxin. Are you crying? No. You I crying because you're so happy? Oh, stop it. Now don't open up the car because I left a filament thread. What? What? Oh, that's the mechanic. What are you talking about? The mechanic. He leaves a note. Oh, the oh. Is, is a 13-second filament thread that's just been broken. You're dead. Boom. Boom, you're dead. Dave's talking about the Charles Bronson and... Is it Vince Van Patten? It's not Vince Van Patten. Who is it? Jan Michael Vincent. Jan Michael Vincent. The movie The Mechanic. Steve, if you read this, it means I didn't make it back. It also means you've broken a filament controlling a 13-second delay trigger. End of game. Bang, you're dead. So uh, I... Okay. Yes? yes? Yeah, that's, that's, that's good. Right. So uh, it was 10... It was 10... What was 10? <laughs> Hold on. Is that mac and cheese? No, there was this one is mac and cheese. The grabby needs a seat. Grabby, here's the second mac and cheese. I don't need that one. So I'm just trying to get our meals straight. We've never eaten anything, right? Oh, From this? this? Yeah. Because no. it says there's 10 portions of oatmeal 
but this is the last bag. So I don't know that there's enough breakfast for everyone. Maybe well, just the kids get the breakfast. Maybe the kids can not have breakfast. This is, I'll eat all the breakfast. All right. This is homestyle potato soup made with hearty potatoes and onions in a creamy chicken flavored broth. That sounds good. It's, it, it all sounds great to me. Another four serving pack. Uh, more water, more whisking, and more 15 or 20 minutes. So this was, I think we're, we're, I think we're low a breakfast. Know what you mean. There's a breakfast missing. Well, this there? is supposed to be for a week, right? Mm -hmm. But that breakfast was only 10 servings. And I think this is supposed to be a, a week for, for a family of four. Am I mistaken? Is it just two people, maybe? Maybe this is just two people. Maybe I'm mistaken. One week emergency food supply. Four. One person. Have ha a look. Wait, what does it say? This is for one person? Yeah, well, look on the front. Oh, this is a one person thing? Oh, I had no idea. That's, well, that's, that makes a whole difference. Then this is way more than one, this is way more food than one person would need for a week. Mm -hmm. In my opinion. In my Especially humble you, opinion. Yeah, if you were trying to ration. So I think our next step is to make one or all of these things. If you had to, and, if, and it goes back in pretty nice actually. I, I'm telling you, I'm digging this Ammo box? Is that what you say? The ammo box. I mean, this actually is a nice lunch box, right? You yes. can fit like a nice big thermos, a couple sandwiches, some assorted cakes or fruit. Yeah, not bad. I like it. This is like a it's like a pelican box. Pelican case? Pelican case. Pelican case. All right. So this was I think it was thirty nine ninety nine. We got it a year ago. Uh, it was just a special on RSBN, but Anthony Cumia, CompoundMedia.com star, he's got a special where it's four weeks, I think, for two hundred and two hundred and forty dollars, maybe. But it's four weeks of food for a family of four, so that's a way better deal. So, uh, what is that? What is that website? PrepareWithCompoundMedia.com. I think we should probably do that. Do what? Prepare. We should probably order a month's worth from Aunt oh, geez. and uh, and then eat this one. So, uh, okay. So that's been this unboxing. It's been a pleasure. Did you enjoy it? Oh, yeah. It was interesting. You were a little grabby, though. I like to grab stuff. <laughs> I know. All right. See you when we start making this stuff. Yeah, diggish. Diggish.